Let's get the latest now from Rula Amin, who joins us from uh, Beirut. Uh, Rula, we often get these different versions of events uh, when it comes to uh, the conflict in Syria. But in this case, at least as far as uh, who's in control of uh, El Qusayr, it seems both sides are pretty much saying the same thing. Yes, they are. For the government, this is a strategic gain. And the government is trying to portray this as a major victory. They want to use it to boost the morales of their troops and the Syrian army. And they want to tell the world that President Assad is still strong on the ground. He has the upper hand, despite all the enforcements that the rebels had sent to Qusayr. The Syrian army, along with the Hezbollah fighters, were able to take it over in about two weeks. Now, for the rebels, it's a severe blow. This is a strategic lose. This was an important town for them to get weapons and fighters from Lebanon. It was also a very important town, a base for the rebels to get to Homs. So the fear now and the concern for the rebels is that the army, the Syrian army, is going to start now pushing uh, forward with its offensive against the rebels elsewhere in the country, in Homs to the north of Qusayr and in the, uh, to the southern part of Qusayr to Zabadani and Madaya. So people understand that this is not just a one-time battle. This is a battle that's going to enable the Syrian army to push forward and to even attack other areas for the rebels, like a strong, their strongholds in Homs, with a, more, with, with a better edge. And, and Rula, how does this affect the, the situation elsewhere in, in Syria and, and the bigger picture? Well, the army is, the Syrian army is making other advances, not only in Qusayr. Qusayr is a very strategic town and it has become a symbolic battle. But they're also making advances around the capital, Damascus. Even as we're speaking, there's a very, very, not only fierce battles, but shelling and very tight sieges to areas around Damascus, especially in eastern Ghouta. The army is trying to clear these areas from the rebels and regain full control over there. Same case in the southern parts of the country near Dura. And the army is pushing to, uh, its forces up in the north, even around Hama, around Homs and Rustan. So the rebels, they, yes, they pulled out of Qusayr, but probably they're trying to regroup to defend other areas they feel that are going to be the next target now for the government forces. All right, for the moment, Rula Amin, live for us in Beirut. Thanks very much.